Good morning children. Now we shall learn more about LCM which is least common multiple and for this we will use another method which is called prime factorization method. First let us revise what is LCM. LCM or lowest common multiple of two or more given numbers is the lowest of their common multiples. Now let us find the LCM of 30 and 45 using the prime factorization method. So let us do it. We write 30 here and we need to divide 30 by the least prime number. Since 30 is an even number we can start dividing by 2. 2 15's are 30. Now here 15 is an odd number. So we'll try to divide it by 3. Yes it can be done. So 3 5's are 15. Now 5 is a prime number and it is divisible by itself for 1. So 5 1's are 5. So here is the prime factorization of 30. So we can write 30 as 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5. So this was the prime factorization of 30. Now what is the prime factorization of 45? Let us do it. We write down 45 here. Since 45 is an odd number, we'll try to divide it by 3. Yes, it does divide by 45. So 3 1's are 3, 3 5's are 15. So 15 comes here. Again, it is divisible by 3. So 3 5's are 15. Now 5 is here and 5 is a prime number so it is divisible by itself for 1. So 5 1's are 5. Here we did prime factorization of 45 meaning all these divisors are prime numbers. So 45 is equal to 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5. Now let us find the common factors of 45 and 30. 30 is equal to 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5 and 45 is equal to 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5 which we found out using the prime factorization method. Now what are the common factors here? They are 3 and 5. So these two are the common factors of 30 and 45. Next let us find what are the other factors of 45 and 30. Here they are 2 and 3 because these are the common factors. So 2 and 3 are the other factors or you can say the uncommon factors of 30 and 45. Now how to find the LCM of 30 and 45? We multiply 2 and 3 which are the other factors of 30 and 45 and we also multiply 3 and 5 which are the common factors of 30 and 45. So we get the LCM by multiplying the common factors and the other factors of the two numbers and we get the LCM. So the LCM is equal to 90. Understood? Let us see in brief how we find LCM using the prime factorization method. So first we find the prime factorization of given numbers like for 45 we found out 
45 is equal to 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5 and for 30 it was equal to 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5. First find the prime factorization of given numbers like for 45 we found out 3 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5 and for 30 it is equal to 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 5 next we find the common factors like here for 30 and 45 they were 3 and 5 next we find the other factors which are uncommon so they were 2 and 3 for 30 and 45 next what do we do we multiply the common and the other factors that is the uncommon factors and we get the LCM like we multiplied 2 3 and 3 and 5 which were the common factors and the uncommon factors and we got the answer as 90 so the LCM was 90 so now you know how to find LCM by the prime factorization method that's all for now bye bye children